What's up YouTube? I'm gonna go ahead and do an unboxing and a quick overview of this Gorillapod Mini. I believe this is the smallest Gorillapod you can get from this company um, as a tripod. There's a little picture of it there. It's pretty cool. I didn't know they made one this small. I might just go ahead and use it for my uh, little action camera whenever I'm just walking around, you know, holding it by hand and filming. I can use this, it's really small. I don't really like those big, huge Gorilla Pods that everybody uses that are about this long. Kind of ugly. <laughs> and this is cool, it's like mini status. So, yeah, let's go ahead and open it up. It's got a little tape right here to hold it closed. <clears throat> Comes in a cool little box too. There it is, the baby G pod. It's so mini. This thing is puny. it in the hand <laughs> and these feet are magnetic too so if you want to stick it to the side of something metal maybe your refrigerator or a car or whatever the heck <laughs> it'll stick to it right here this is rubber so it's kind of got a grip for when you tighten on your camera this is also rubber right here and it says Joby right there yeah right there it says Joby it's pretty cool Let's go, and go ahead and attach my action camera and see what it looks like. That's pretty cool. And then so if you're just walking around, you know, filming, it's like a little handle. Really discreet. You can barely even see it in your hand. You know, if you're going in a store or something and you're trying to film, you don't want to be so noticeable. This is perfect. Discreet G-Pod. I gotta say though, it is a little hard getting the legs to go where you want them to go. You gotta like play with it for a little bit. But overall, I really like it. The quality feels like it's there. It's got rubber around each one of these little things, so it's really comfortable to hold. Looks cool. And it's mini. There it is. Now I don't think you would want to use this tripod on say anything bigger like this. I would pretty much consider this a medium sized camera. I don't, it might be a little too heavy for that tripod. We can try it on there. Definitely not going to want to put a full size DSLR on there or anything like that. <clears throat> As you can see here it's suited mostly for uh, compact point and shoot cameras but as for my action camera it, you know, it's, that's even smaller than a point and shoot, so it's perfect. And these aren't very pricey either. You can get them for under $15. I 
I guess it's even strong enough to hold this uh, mirrorless medium-sized camera. <clears throat> Holds it just fine. And then also, just like with the action camera, you can use it as a handle. Looks kind of funny on there though. <laughs> Yeah, but I'll mostly be using it for the action camera. I think it's a perfect handle for it. So yeah, I'm sure you can get these on Amazon if you're interested in one. Like I said, they're, I think, under $15. So I'll try to leave a link if I can in the description so you can easily find it. The product by Joby. So yeah, this is the G-Pod.